everyone. Welcome to today's video. Hi, Penny Pickle. She's peeing. <laughs> oh, it's just crazy. Oh my gosh. Good morning, guys. Welcome to today. Good morning, Gabby. Good morning, Sophie. She's already in there setting things up. I want to play. I want to play. Today's supposed to be our playing day. Our day with our mares. Our fun. To oh, <laughs> did you guys see that? <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh, Molly just started jumping it. Yeah. She, she did. Like when I was walking here, Sophie was straightening that out and she just flew over it twice. And uh, Ruby is cat watching. Seeing if there's a cat. Because that's her favorite thing. <laughs> like, <laughs> I, just, I love a dog that likes to have fun. When you have horses and you have dogs and you have pets and you can play with them, it keeps you young forever. That's why I look like I'm 30. No, just joking. <laughs> I think uh, all the stress from all of it has aged me. <laughs> well, hmm. What happened to you last night, Penny Pickle? Listen, you remember the rules. First a brush, then a treat. What the heck? Oh uh, my gosh. We're gonna try a changing the order of the pony parade. Willow first, Willow first and then Penny. <laughs> There's nothing scary under here. She's so fuzzy still. All right, let's go in, let's go in, and then Gracie. See if she just goes right out. No, because she's <laughs> human more than her actual Yeah, so girl. now we confused her. We have nobody to push her out. Gabby, brush her. Wow. So I'm pretty sure Gracie doesn't want to go first, and she doesn't want to go last. She just doesn't want to go at all. She wants to be with the people. Look at that cute butt. Those are good ponies. Like, I, I, oh. <laughs> What's happening here? What is wrong with you? Hey, you She's just sitting there. <laughs> you guys, look at our eggs. These are our eggs from yesterday and today. Look at our egg carton. Isn't it so beautiful? There's only one other color that I really, 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 really want. I want the really dark brown eggs, but we don't even have to color eggs for Easter. That's how amazing our eggs look every day. Hey you guys, you won't believe what happened. We came to the barn to drop off some grain. I'm gonna drop off a bag of grain. <laughs> we 
we get here? And there's a new horse in the field. There's a new horse in our field. The horse Brandon bought for us. <laughs> and it's a tiny baby. And she's look at she's eating. Hey, I'm so proud of them. Look at you guys. A baby fool. A baby fool hopped into our field. Look it. And all the horses are letting her eat the hay. Like how gentle is that? We gotta go find her uh, a halter. <laughs> oh, I'm caught. I don't know if we can even catch a foal. <laughs> Hi, cute little foal. <laughs> it's literally a foal. Hi. <laughs> You know me, don't you? You know I'll bring treats. I actually was eating celery and ended up with these in my pocket. We need to figure out how she got in here. Grayfin's terrified. Grayfin's terrified. He's like, what the heck? <laughs> Aw, you're fun. such a nice pony. Like, I don't care about it as long as I can eat my food. All right, watch out, other horses. This is all about the foal. <laughs> yeah. There's a baby in your field. There's you a baby. And you guys are so good to her. Can you catch her? Um, well, I was petting her. All right, so I'm being chased. Yep, I'm being chased because I got carrots in my pocket. I just want to see how she got in. See if I can, oh, there's a fence. <laughs> Hello, little baby. <laughs> oh my goodness, our horses are ch chicken of a baby. Maybe she'll go back out. I wonder if that's how she came in. She's cute. Let's see if we can handle a foal. We can handle a foal. All right, so Sophie caught her. All right, walk her through the field. She's pretty good. Yeah, she's cute. I know, you live with Sparksy. She's like, I want to go back to my field. She looks, she looks like she knows. And then, <laughs> our horses. They're like, help! There's a baby in our field! <laughs> and it's a girl! <laughs> There's a girl in the castle! Who knows what movie that's from? I literally am the kind of person that can never... That's from Beauty and the Beast. Yeah, I am... I do not remember. Uh-oh. Alright, Gabby. They're like brave now because they're behind Gabby. <laughs> yeah, shoo them away. Uh-oh. Mom, shoo them away. Shoo. <laughs> Shoo! Shoo! <laughs> oh my god. I'm not cut out for this. Finn be looking so handsome though. You are such a beautiful so pony. Grayson hates her. Grayson gives her the butt. <laughs> He's like, I, I think they're I think they were all afraid of her and now they just want to see who she is. She goes over there smelling her butt. And I am standing behind the trees. In case there's a rampage. No, not a rampage. In case there's a, what's it called? <laughs> stampede. I don't want to be involved in any stampedes. Literally, I don't like to be the one holding the carrots because all the horses want to be with me. I'm the cool one. Go away. Go. Look at how gorgeous they are though. Like, I love spring. Left my spot in the trees. Come here, babe. Oh, I mean, her field only connects there. Yeah. All right, so Gabby's not even sure. Oh, there she goes. <laughs> She's walking. She's like, I don't know you. I want my friends. <laughs> she wants to stay with the boys. To be honest, she might keep them all under control. I hear noises behind me. I just want the heck out of here. Come on, Grayson, go. The girls think that she came through this fence, so I'm gonna try and secure it better. It's secure now, hopefully. Oh, Come on. Open that no, no, and then stop. There we go. See, people think I'm useless. I don't think you are. Oh, I'm, I'm useless. Just walk on a... Well, we could be here all day. <laughs> well, Gabby tries maybe to get the foal moving. Try and leave her. Yeah, maybe. Because Gabby and Sophie has a different kind of presence. Let's let Sophie have a try. She tried. Oh. For like five seconds. Uh oh. Work. Now all the horses. See, maybe she just doesn't want to walk by the horses. Oh man, isn't this a conundrum? We got a new foal. Show up at the barn and there's a new horse in our field. All right, so we changed our 
plan. I'll watch Sparky. Sparky, you can't run out, okay? Oh, he's so cute. We want to be really careful because, like, she's there. She wanted to come home. She's like, that's my home. There we go. She's feisty now. <laughs> Good job, boys. We're so proud of you. You protected your home. Chino protected all the boys. No, they didn't. <laughs> oh, did you see that hog? They love each other. So when you carry carrots in your pocket, horses can smell that stuff. So now I got Sparky here. Don't you bite me. Do you think it'd be bad if I ran? <laughs> think they'd chase me if I ran? Oh, you thought they chase. God. Ha! I win. <laughs> anyway, that was our adventure with a baby, with a baby horse. And it was cute and adorable and fun. Also, I dropped off a bag of grain because normally, I told you guys before, I make up these bags of food. It's so hard. Now that spring is here, I'm just like, yeah, I'll give them this many scoops. <laughs> I, I gave up on it. I'm done with it. It's over with. <laughs> You're on your own. <sighs> I feel good. We rescued a baby. All right, Gabby rescued a baby. She's so cute. We, did, we are not ready for a baby. Bye, boys. <laughs> no messing with girls. <laughs> They're all coming. They're like, we'll come with you. They probably dared her to do it. <laughs> yeah, they probably dared her to do it. Wow, you got, what is that on your neck? It's a lot of dirt. That's them. Our three boys, Grayfin, leave them alone. Chino, make them all be kind. Uh-oh. He's, He's trying to itch. <laughs> that was weird. Here, here, here go. Here, Great. white gray fin. All right. Goodbye, boys. Bye, Finny. Goodbye, Finny and Finny and Chino. Hey, Chino. Our work here is done. Man, that was fun, though. I love spring. I love getting out and being out in the spring air and seeing people and yeah, horses jump into our horses' field. That's how amazing That's our horses are. I got licked. <laughs> you got licked? Yeah, Sparky licked me. Yeah, he uh, licked everyone. Well, he tried to nip me. He's like, I oh, know you got carrots in your pocket. In Chino! Good job, Chino. Chino, no! <laughs> Chino's pawing. He stopped. He stopped. <laughs> yeah. He's like, oh man, she always knows what I'm doing. It's absolutely gorgeous out here, you guys. I'm headed to pick up Ruby and I'm excited to see her. She did really well this time when she went to get her hair cut. Um, usually she's like so shy and like doesn't want to go and cries for us. This time she sat beside me beautifully. And then when she took her, she said, come on Ruby and Ruby ran with her. She's like, take me out. Hey, I don't. <laughs> Dogs are literally so smart. I had to park in a different spot and she, oh there she, now she knows <laughs> that's my car. She knew what the spot was wrong. Isn't she cute? Yeah. <laughs> she was screaming. She was screaming for me. I actually really love where we get her groomed. Like, I don't know if you're like us, but over the course of a lot of years, We've had a lot of dogs, especially golden doodles and poodles groomed. And this place is like the nicest place. They're just so kind all the time to everyone. Always happy. I don't even know how they do that because nobody's always happy. Oh, okay. <laughs> it's been a lot of running, you guys. We've rescued a horse, a fool, got our dog groomed. Now we have one more place we want to stop before we go home. And what is it? We're going to see something. I'll show you guys when we get there. What are we seeing? You'll see. I'm glad you're back, Ruby Roo. I'm glad you're back, Ruby. She's so excited. She's out of breath. <laughs> yeah, she was so happy. Do you guys remember the place that the sales barn that we go every year? We go a few times every year and we look like for horses that are being sold or we look for chickens mostly. Like they always have this really great outside chicken sale like these people who come here and sell chickens and i really want a specific kind of chicken i think it's called a uh, copper moran copper moran i think it is it's got the really dark eggs 
And so when COVID started, the chicken people stopped coming and now that COVID is kind of finished and you don't even have to wear masks anymore, I was like hoping so much that the chicken people would be back. And so that's where we are. You can see all the trucks and stuff bringing all their livestock. But no chicken guy. That's so sad. Don't you know that you're beautiful?